gonna be shooting into my bathroom today. Um, we got the wave in. We got the chrono bell here. I'm gonna amp this up to 12 dots. And, uh, let's get going. The battery's on full charge. So this isn't an accurate test. But this is how we're gonna walk today. Sorry if I'm blocking the camera, by the way. 47.4. Fifty one point two. Fifty one point nine. Forty nine point seven. Forty nine point three. Forty nine point two. Fifty one point nine. Fifty 46.6, 6, 51.5, 47.8, and 48.2. So it averages around 50 FPS. Now let me tell you, this is an older Lee Blaster. This is the start. So this is the performance that you see out of a blue strife. Um, Ravens, you know, original rapid strike, cost stockades. So these are the original. However, if you was to go online now without something like the Infinis, you can't see it. But the Infinis over there, now you get 70 or 80 FPS simply because that's a newer blast with better flywheels. Even the XD Rob Strike, the Hot Fire, the Hellfire, um, new editions of the Strike, even. I got a battle camo strike in there. It shoots hot, maybe 70 feet per second. Um, I also have a modified strike. But we're not going to talk about that. That can get up to 100 feet per second. Anyways, talking business up in here. Just saying, the Raven Fire is a do not buy. Why are the Raven? It's not a, oh yeah, don't buy this gun. It's a, you can't. Unless you want to spend a hundred or something dollars on this gun, I would not recommend it. Um, just buy a wave and...